Shares time. of Intel are getting crunched here. The chip maker <laughs> shares down more than 10% over the past week, but options traders are betting there could be a turnaround for Intel. Kelly Intelligence CEO Kevin Kelly joins us with the action, the options action. Kevin. Hi, Dom. Yeah, today we actually saw 1.3 times the amount of calls versus puts in Intel. And this is a stock that has a it implied volatility of about 34. And today we saw the most active contracts actually took us all the way out to December and they went to the 38 strike calls, which is almost about 10 percent higher here. And we saw over 18,000 contracts trade in that strike. So it closed today around 123. So there could be a Santa Claus rally uh, for the option betters in Intel. So I'm long Intel. I, I don't think that there was anything delivered in the last 48 hours that really changes the investment thesis here. Um, it's nice that they are bringing something forth in AI. They're clearly uh, you're not buying the stock for AI. You're buying it on a turnaround that I think valuation makes sense. They have some support. Some of these products that they announced are, are interesting. I think the data center erosion is something that at least they put the they put the floor underneath. It's interesting, though, that it was kind of like a dash for trash. I think that narrative kind of worked its way into Intel. Intel is like misexecuted on almost every major technology technological shift over the last five years and so it's easy to buy a stock like this cheap but look at AMD you know AMD was trading about 130 um, in June and here we are now we're just above a hundred dollars or so and that had a little bit of that Nvidia pixie dust you know in May into June so I just think a lot of those names it's gonna like when the rubber hits the road if they don't have the actual product and they don't have an advance in the technology you know to me I, I think the investors will stiffen out and that's what they did in Intel